My name is Jonah. And you can dodge a wrench. Why, why'd you do that? I'm sorry, I thought we were still running on that joke. No, you can't interrupt me. I'm sorry. And I'm Edwin. Please, please stand and rise for a moment of silence and a pledge to the flag. Today, a representative from Newman College will be here at 8 o'clock, a representative from Hood College will be here at 9 o'clock, a representative from Johnson and Wales University will be here at 1.15, and a representative from the University of New Haven will be here at 1.45. Tomorrow, a representative from Westminster College will be here at 8 o'clock, and a representative from Lock Haven University will be here at 9. If you are interested in meeting with a representative from any of these glorious colleges, please sign up in Naviance or see Mrs. Stitzler in the guidance office. There is a regular meeting of the cloister at yearbook today, after school in Mr. Bischoff's room. See you there. Are you a movie buff? Do you enjoy a good story about someone overcoming odds? Join the Media Center on November 16th, immediately after school, for a free screening of Underwater Dreams. It's the epic story of how the sons of undocumented Mexican immigrants learned how to build an underwater robot from Home Depot parts and defeat engineering powerhouse MIT in the process. Talk about adaptability and grit. Refreshments will be provided. Now over to Nate Dog with the news. All right, King Salman of Saudi Arabia has begun a series of purges, detaining many members of his government and can you scroll down? And of the social elite, the anti-corruption purge began a few days ago on Saturday as part of King Salman's Vision 2030, his modernization and westernization plan for Saudi Arabia. The purges have been applauded by U.S. President Donald Trump. Speaking of U.S. President Donald Trump, he is to visit South Korea today, and it has many of his staff nervous. The meeting is expected to become a political minefield, or could we say, Minecraft? Get, 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 get it? Get, anyway, the <laughs> shifting of North Korea sites from South Korea to the U.S. and the increased competition of China for diplomatic friendship with South Korea have shifted a geo geopolitical system that has been static for decades. Typhoon Damri swept across central Vietnam over the weekend, leaving 61 dead and 28 reported missing. Approximately 2,000 houses collapsed and over 80,000 were damaged in some capacity. This comes before the president, Donald Trump, is... Or, messed it up. Anyway, Donald Trump is set to visit Vietnam within a week of the last leg of his Asian Pacific tour. We have another election related this day in history for you guys today. President Franklin D. Roosevelt was elected for his third time today. Roosevelt was first elected in 1932 as he promised to lead Americans out of the Great Depression. By the time he was elected in 1940, World War II would already be in full swing across the ocean in Europe and the American public figured that he was doing such a great job, why not elect him again? He would go on, go on to win a fourth term, while the Americans knew that electing a different president in the middle of war would probably not be the best idea. FDR truly was one of the most influential presidents in history. But before we go over to lunch today, check out this video on food waste here at the EHS. Do your part and use the share table or save it for later. When monitoring how much food waste was accumulated throughout the three lunch periods, this is what was found. Keep in mind, this is just one meal period out of 180 school days. Did you know you only have to take one fruit or veggie, but you can take up to two fruits and two veggies if you choose? If you end up with extra food that you think you are not going to eat, you can always bring your extra food with you to eat at a later time. Please also utilize the share table if you don't want to bring your food with you. You can add foods like bananas, oranges, applesauce, unopened muffins, uncrustables, apple slices, or milk. This is a great way to pay it forward to others who need it and to reduce your waste. Today for lunch, we have a pasta bowl with meat sauce or chicken alfredo with a whole grain garlic breadstick. Also known as WG. WG. Whole grain. BBQ, also known as barbecue bacon chicken sandwich. Papa John's pizza, yum yum. That is pretty tasty. A ham club on toast, not bread, but toast. Uh, fr fruit and fruit. yogurt. Oh, that word's fruit. <laughs> fruit and yogurt parfait with a muffin. A buffalo, it's that free range buffalo chicken salad. Are you sure it's free range? It is free range. Wow. It's cold, it's good. Roasted cauliflower. I'd pass on that one, but that's yeah. okay. Tomato and zucchini medley. Not just tomato and zucchini, but a medley, medley of sorts. Grape tomatoes with dip. 
in assorted fr fresh fruit. There's that fruit word again. Or a slushy. 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 Hey, it's election day, and I know who I'm going to be voting for. That's for you, Mrs. Mellinger and Lord Hagen IV. Anyway, uh, there are no sports resorts, but reminder to all ninth grade boys wishing to try out for basketball this season. There will be an open gym this afternoon from 3.15 to 4.45 at the middle school. Also, the junior versus senior Powerpuff game is this Wednesday, November 8th, starting at 8, oh, at 7 p.m., not, not 8, at the war. Remember to come on out and cheer on your lady mounts. Let's go seniors! The rifle team will be holding an open gym before the season starts. That's for you, Joel Potts. Anyone interested, please meet the coach by the high school main entrance at 6 p.m. on November 9th. If you have any questions, see Mrs. Cummings in the athletic office. Please come out and support the boys soccer team as they take on Conestoga in the first round of the PIAA state championships at Downingtown West High School tonight at 7 p.m. Admission prices are $3 for students and $6 for adults. Let's go mounts! Now back to the main deck. Shoo! Ah! STEM Sisters is hosting another event on November 16th from 5 to 8. You can get hands-on experience in cardiac sonography, engineering, or radiologic tech labs at Hacks Lancaster Campus. Dinner is provided, but you gotta register. See Mrs. Hull or register or register to register, or go to the North Museum's website, maybe. <laughs> the school counseling office is holding a contest to look for artwork to feature on the cover of the 2018-2019 course selection guidebook. If you are interested, please download a copy of their information sheet that has been posted in your Schoology newsfeed. The submission deadline is November 22nd, so do not delay. Hey, I want to tell the announcements. Oh, okay. One more announcement. Hey, ro 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 Robot Club members, big, big, big. Did I mention it's big? Yeah. Uh, a, a big meeting tomorrow night. If you can, please plan on hanging in there until 6 o'clock. Bring $5 for pizza and drink. Yeah, baby! Robot party! Now, uh, that's the show. Get off the stage. Get off. Have a tasty Tuesday. That's, that's weird. <laughs> <laughs>